welcome back to our channel. Today is the nursery tour. It's finally here. So this is what the room looks like from the door. Kind of just glance around real quick. And then I'll take you wall by wall. So the first wall is the crib wall. And I will tell you everything that's on the crib wall. First is this Cynthia Rowley light switch from Home Goods, and then right up under it to hold her stuffed animals and pillows when she's sleeping is this laundry hamper that we purchased from Walmart. Then up over the crib we have these two wooden frames that are from Walmart with scrapbook paper inside of them, and then this deer frame that we purchased from Hobby Lobby. Next is her crib and I'm absolutely obsessed with it. We purchased it from Walmart. It's a dream on me crib and it is a four in one so it converts to like a full size bed later on in her life and we love it. Inside the crib we have this super cute sheet that we purchased from Target and then there's a pillow that we purchased from Bargain Hunt her boppy pillow that we've got as a baby shower gift, and then all of her stuffed animals. Two of them were a baby shower gift, and one has her heartbeat inside of it. Then up under the crib, we have these coral bins. These were purchased from Target, and on the front, they just have a clothespin um, chalkboard that has what's written, or what's inside of them written on it. And yes, I know, I misspelled swaddlers. It's okay though, I'll fix it eventually. <laughs> The next wall is the changing table wall, which is beautiful. I love the way this table turned out, the changing table. My husband did such a good job on it. The first thing over the changing table is this picture frame that we got from Goodwill with the M inside it. That's from Hobby Lobby. And then this hanger, the arrow hanger, is from Earthbound Trading Company. And the outfits are from Carter's. And then this cabinet we purchased from Home Goods several years ago and it holds her headbands inside of it. The changing pad is from Walmart and the changing pad cover is from Babies R Us. Then I have this little box over here that is from Dollar General. The shoes are from Walmart and the sign is from Joann Fabrics. Then the knobs on the dresser are all from Hobby Lobby. And this dresser we've had for years and years. It was my husband's long before we got together. And then over in the corner, we have her laundry hamper that we got from Walmart. Then you have our gallery wall with the window, which my mother-in-law did the best job on these curtains, I'm telling you. And the chair. I'm obsessed with the chair and the pop of color that it brings. So the first thing up here is this M, which was from an antique store. Then we have these white shelves from Target. There's three of them. The shoes are from Walmart and the frame is from Walmart. I'm not sure where the candle's from. This arrow is from Joann Fabrics. This deer is signed by everybody at her gender reveal and it is from Hobby Lobby. Up here we have this cactus that was from Kirkland's and I painted the pot gold. Then we have another one of those Walmart picture frames with a scripture from Etsy inside of it. It is my favorite piece in the whole entire room. Then down on this shelf we just have some milk glass, a sign from Kirkland's, and our dear ornament that we got for our first Christmas. On this table this lamp and the shade are from Walmart. The sign is from Dollar Tree and the cup was from Joann's and that tray was made for me by a friend a long time ago. This top basket is from Home Goods, and the bottom one's from Hobby Lobby. We bought these curtain rods at a yard sale, and the fabric is from Joann's. These blinds are from Lowe's, and they are amazing one-touch dark-out blinds. And then these knobs that we use as ties are from Hobby Lobby as well. And then we just have this cross in the corner, and it is also from Hobby Lobby. And then the last wall comes back around towards the door. So you have my work closet over there. And then this cabinet which holds a bunch of like socks and things like that. Oh, there's Toby. Just hanging out. Like usual. This cabinet is the first piece we had and it's the inspiration for the entire room. And it is from Hobby Lobby and you can definitely still purchase it there.
On top of the cabinet, we have this picture frame that's from Dollar Tree. The wood piece and the deer are both from my baby shower. There are two pieces of antique milk glass and that peony is from Walmart. This little pink dish is from Hobby Lobby. And then there is a mason jar with my great grandmother's antique buttons inside of it. And then of course our monitor. Then up here we have this old barn wood frame. The paper that backs it is from Hobby Lobby and the deer is from Babies R Us. Our rug is from At Home. And then we have our ottoman here and the quilt on top of it was made by my mother-in-law. The cushions for the ottoman and the chair were both made, made by my mother-in-law. And the chair we got off of Craigslist. And that is it for her nursery tour. We are absolutely obsessed with the way that it looks and we hope that you enjoy it too. Thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you next time. Bye guys.